So we're given three-fifths of the students in a school are female, and 90% of all students are right-handed. What is the probability that a randomly selected picked student is a left-handed male? Okay, so there are three-fifths. So the probability there's a female is three-fifths. That means the probability there's a male is one minus three-fifths, which is two-fifths. And then the probability that a person is right-handed is 90%. That means the probability that a person is left-handed is 1 minus 0.9, which is 0.1. So if you want to pick a student that is a left-handed male, then that is the same thing as multiplying the probability that a person is left-handed with the probability that a person is male. So left-handed is 0.1. Probability that there's a male is 2 fifths. So this is 0.04. Okay, so this is for part A. Now for part B, we want to give an example for possible distribution of students. So we want to take into account all the possible combinations. Okay, so we want to find the probability So this will be all left-handed people column. This is the right-handed people column. This will be the total. And this is the male row. And this is the female row. And we also need the total row. Okay. So for males, we just found what it was. There's a 10% chance a person is left-handed and two-fifths chance the person is male. So that was 0.04. For female left-handed, we multiply by the probability a person is left-handed, which is 0.1. And then for female, the probability that it's a female, we said is three-fifths. So this is 0 0.06. And if you add up these two probabilities, you end up getting 0.1. Okay. Now for right-handed. Well, the probability a person was left-handed, we said is 0.1. So the probability that a person is right-handed is 0.9. And the probability a person is male, we said is 2 fifths. So that would be 0.36. The probability a person is right-handed, we said is 0.9 probability a person is female is 3 fifths. Multiply these and get 0.54. Now for the total we have to add up 0.36 with 0.54 to get 0.9. And if I add 0.1 with 0.9 I get, I get 1 which is exactly what I want. And now for the male total I have to add 0.04 with 0.36 to get 0.4. And then for female total, it's 0.06 plus 0.54 to get 0.6. And so 0.4 plus 0.6 is 1. So this looks good. And another check we can make is as follows. We know that the probability of female is 3 fifths, which is 0.6. And if we go in the female row, we end up having 0.6. So that's good. For male row, it's 2 fifths, which is 0.4. If we go to the male row, we also get 0.4. The probability we have a right-handed person is 0.9. So this one, we have to go down the column to get 0.9, which is good. And the left-handed person is 0.1, oh, which we also have 0.1. So this looks correct. 